even he doesn't show that he wanted to be touched, right? Well, like I said, it's like, what, how does a guy show that he wants to be touched? Like, what, it, what does a guy do to show you that he wants to be touched? Right now, we, we're, like I was talking about earlier, we're kind of in this place politically around the world, actually, mostly kind of in the West, where there's kind of this weird thing going on around touching women. And so a lot of guys are kind of very, very hesitant about touching women. I've talked to a lot of women that are like, yeah, I've gone on dates with guys and they're like freaked out and scared about touching me and they don't touch me. And it's kind of this thing. And so touching a guy can be really powerful and it kind of gives him permission and makes it so that he feels like he's allowed to touch you without it being kind of this weird thing where he's coming across badly, right? So touching can be fun. And, and if you want to get into touching and you want to make it more normalized, you can just touch everybody, right? Like be a touchy-feely kind of person and just, just touch people. You know, when you're talking to them, touch them on the shoulder or whatever, touch them on their hand, grab their hand, shake their hand, hug them, give people hugs when you talk to them if you know them or even if you don't know them. I like to give people hugs. I'm a, I'm a big hugger. I like to give people, everybody that I talk to, that I even have even slightly or rem remote kind of like <laughs> friendship bond with, I'm like, yeah, you know, like, give me a big hug, right? It's fun.